Lost and Found in Los Angeles, written by Doran Ben Gunner. I arrived in America one Sunday morning, but I did not feel I was here yet. Flying on an airplane from Lagos, Nigeria, to New York City, to Los Angeles, California, did not carry my mind with me right away. Outside my car window, the high, hard, gray rocks did not welcome me. Would this really be home? During my first month, I liked to drive to well-known scholarly areas of Los Angeles, such as Sunset Boulevard, Wilside Boulevard and Rodeo Drive. The buildings there were tall, shiny, and in strange safes. The stores were filled with clothes and other scuttly things I could not imagine buying or wearing. On my way home, I drove to poor areas of Los Angeles. People sat in the street asking for money. The buildings were dirty, and the windows had no class. This area filled me with fear. Which side of America? Would I end up in the rich or the poor? I came to this country with nothing, but I believe I had a chance here. In America, everyone could become rich, right? I was very lonely. I had left all my family behind in Nigeria. When I got tired of staying inside the house, I took walks up to some hills near my house. I want to feel the sun. Touch the warm earth and see the blue sky. That was the same as the one at home. There were no huge trees with thick, spreading branches and heavy green leaves to protect me from the sun. The soil was not dark brown and rich. It was like brown and dry like sand. There were small stone everywhere, and small brown bushes covered the hillside.
again, I had to face the fact that this was not home, which was all I had known. Only the strong, steady sign of the sun was the same. That at least made me happy. The sun was my first friend.